the house didn't know about it. They brought it in. The workers brought it in themselves. Pay from me. How the hell you know it's you? Unless someone comes in, you just stop right there, sir, and they check you. They search you, like they do over the border. Okay, you're good. Oh, oh you have them, all right, leave, you know? But, so you don't really know, unless you have that person standing at the door searching everyone. Searching everyone's jackets, searching everyone's clothes. Okay, if you don't have that type of experienced body, uh, uh, like you have, you don't have the type of security at the border like you have, that you used to have at your daughter's office, then if you don't have that, you don't know who brought him in. You can't say it was this guy and that guy. You don't know who what guy. And Laureen said they, they could have been in your chair before you sat in it and it went on you and it went somewhere else. What do you find out? Other people, it doesn't matter. Maybe he never made it to the back room until someone brought him, but it ain't that person that I'm at home, but he but crawled on him and brought him to the back room. Right. Or that part of the waiting room. It could have been there a couple of days and now they're popping up. Yes. That can happen. Yeah, of course. But that shouldn't be anyone's fault. Because no. they, 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 they're coming in everywhere. True. Hell, they can go through walls, electrical outlets, plumbing. Yep. They can go anywhere. Hell, that place could have them from, it could have came from the other, so the next door was the uh, breast, uh, the next door was the uh, other doctor's facility. They could have came through that, through the walls. <laughs> But they haven't reported it, though. No. You don't really know. No. Hell, in Columbus, Ohio, the hospital had bed bugs themselves. That's how Grandma got them one time and went home. Yeah. And her hospital bed had them. Oh. 